In this video, I will solve your doubts about how to connect Trezor to iPhone and whether or not it is possible to do this. As you might be aware, you can easily connect your Trezor to devices like a PC or a laptop and use it in conjunction with Trezor Suite. This is primarily done using a cable. And after the Trezor is connected to that device, you can use the Trezor Suite application to browse through your coins, your assets, and manage everything related to your Trezor. So can you do the same on a mobile device? Many hardware wallets such as Ledger support mobile devices and all that you have to do is connect them using Bluetooth and then access the application. But if you try to do the same with a Trezor, you will notice that even if you enable Bluetooth, you put them in close proximity or you use a cable, nothing will happen. And if we visit the official Trezor forums, a lot of users have asked concerns about connecting the Trezor to an iOS device. So as you can see this one, for example, asks, are there any plans to add send functionality to Trezor Suite on iOS so users can send Bitcoin from their iPhone or iPad? And developers have answered these questions. So as you can see, this person is a developer. And what they said is, connection to Trezor is required in order to send. And on, on iOS, you cannot connect to Trezor. This was in 2024, during November. And January of this year, they said it again. This does not depend on the table, cable type. The iPhone operating system does not allow Trezors to communicate. So sadly, as it stands today, Trezor cannot be connected to an iPhone to access the major functionalities like sending assets and receiving them. Even though you might be able to see your balance inside of the Trezor by connecting it to a smartwatch or even possibly an iPhone, this does not mean that you will be able to transfer points back and forth using Trezor Suit on an iPhone. The purpose of this video is not to spread misinformation, but to let people be aware about the limitations of connecting Trezor to iPhone and why you cannot get this done to use the main functionalities. The iPhone does not support them. If this video cleared up any questions that you had, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.